Hey, welcome to another series of the videos, Google Ads Extensions. In this video, I will show you how to create call extension for your Google Ads account. So stick around and I'll walk you through. But first, let me introduce myself. My name is Johannes Chwana and I'm CEO and founder of Discover My Business. I have been running Google Ads for almost seven years. So let's go back to your Google Ads account. On the top left side, click All Campaigns, then Campaigns, then uh, Pick the Ads extensions and you are in the main, main section of the extension click plus sign uh, plus icon and pick call extension so in a previous video i showed you how to create site link extension call out extension and um, if you didn't watch there's the links for uh, site link extension and there's the link for call out extension um, this one is pretty easy. We're using under the campaign level, depending on what kind of services we provide. We're trying to have a separate phone number for each service so we can track the quality. In this particular case, we will use just only one campaign under the campaign level, uh, create new or use existing one. Uh, back in 2019, Google switched the dashboard. So if you have old phone numbers, delete them, create the new ones. We will use our office phone number from our website. Uh, just give me a moment okay use this format uh, here's the example actually also manage conversions make sure you have conversions set up on your Google Ads account click plus sign on calls call from using call extension call only ad. click continue uh, name this phone Call leads don't use value one sixty second will be conversion yes last click yes okay save continue done okay go back to the page we will reload this one more time okay again edit We're not using mobile, we will use on all devices automatically. So uh, don't forget we pick campaign level, click save. And that's it. This is how you're adding a call extension to your campaign. Wait for within two to four hours and it will be approved. Again, in the next video, I will show you how to create structured snippet extension. So see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. Bye.